Hi guys, it's Chris at Cork and Crown, back in my, well not in my shed, in a garden in Devon with some more cider to try. And it is cider, it's not wine today. We had wine last time and cheese, very nice it was too. Um, we have got this. Barter Street Cider Normandy style cider. I've been keeping this for a while, wanted to try it for a while. I've tried to get in touch with these people a few times to no avail. So I'm going to keep trying. But I love Normandy style, uh, style ciders. So as per usual, this one is low in alcohol. It's 3.1%. Volume, what did it say on the back? A naturally sweet cider made from eight varieties of apple, pure juice, keeved in the Normandy style. A rich, satisfying, naturally carbonated cider. So we expect some residual apple sugars in there. All of which I love. So let's get this cork out. Hopefully it won't blow up on me, as has happened several times in the past. Makes good telly, but not for good laundry. Hang on. No, that's fine. Oh, here it's going to go. Pop. So for those of you who don't know, keeve cider, um, so keeve is a process by which you remove protein and yeast from the juice, which means it won't fully ferment. So you have residual sugar left over that the, that the yeast haven't fermented and it's naturally low ABV, so 3.1 in this case, which is exceptionally low actually. So let's have a look at the colour, bit hazy, but it's unfiltered, nice head on it, as you expect, so bottle conditioned, it'll be pet nut I think, so bottle before fermentation's finished, to give you the bubbles, yeah nice head on that and it's keeping it as well. Lovely colour, nice bright, well it's not bright, it's hazy, but it's a lovely sort of marmalade amber, I'd call that. Let's have a smell. It's got a tweet there, hope you appreciate that. It smells of amazing baked apple, which is exactly what I expected it to smell of, and it does indeed smell of that. Amazing, and a little bit, I'm getting a lot of orange lately on the nose on these things, I don't think it's my imagination, but this has got a certain like, marmalade orange character as well, I think. Yeah, baked apple, orange, it smells great. It smells like a dessert is what it smells like. So let's try it. Mm. Yeah, quite a lot of residual sugar in that. Hence the low ABV, 2.1. But bloody hell, I really like it. I really like it. Look, it almost feels viscous because of the sugar. Um, the bubbles are brilliant, really fine. Um, tannin, very little to speak of. I'm not sure what varietals they're using. Yeah, minimal tannin, low acid. Again, totally what you expect from a Normandy cider or a Normandy style cider. If you don't like sweet cider, you ain't going to like this. If you like French cider, you're going to absolutely love this. It's absolutely delicious. My wife is actually just sitting off camera. I'm trying not to distract. Yeah, she's waving her head off. I'm try she's going to like this. I guarantee she will like Hang on, try that. Try that. She doesn't like cider. It's crazy. She doesn't like cider. I mean, I get to drink more cider because she doesn't like cider. However, from time to time, it smells lovely. It's her verdict on the smell. Hold on. Oh, yes, she says. Oh, yes. There you go. If my, if my wife likes it, it must be good cider. Oh, really cheap sweet cider <laughs> those are the only two things you'll drink that my friends is an excellent excellent normandy style cider from barter street and if you haven't had some i recommend you get it because if you like this style of thing you will really like this there is a, this is an excellent yeah sort of uh, apple stone fruit honey great bubbles um almost feel sticky it's absolutely brilliant I'm going to keep pestering these people because I want to sell their stuff. Hopefully they'll watch this and decide, yes, there's a man we want to work with. Or maybe not. Let's see how it goes. All right, guys. Thank you for joining me in the garden. I hope you join me again. But until then, cheers.